What's up, guys? It's me, Mario, Home Slide 794. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today, I'm going to show you something uh, on how to how to add a follower alert uh, using OBS. Um, so when you're streaming, you get a nice little song playing. Um, you'll get a, a nice little alert. So whenever your 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 followers there, uh, people watching your stream want to follow, they'll get notified. Um, it'll be on your stream. It'll play a nice little cool song, and it'll be something cool for your uh, your viewers to have on your uh, your stream. So everyone everyone likes that, and it's good to know when you get a new follower too. So let's get started. Obviously, you're going to need OBS. Download that, install it, run it. Next, we are going to go to nightdev.com. I'm at the website already. Just go to your favorite Google, uh, search browser and hit up. Just type in nightdev. All right, it's the first thing that pops up right there, Night Dev. Um, next, just click on Projects, and here are all the ones we do here. I'll make another video with a, a, a streamer tip, a stream tip, but for the, today, we're just going to do Follower Alert. So click on it, hit Install, pretty self-explanatory. And then what you want to do is you're going to have whatever you want to do here. So uh, run, o get OBS download it um, and it's, uh, put it to your desktop and uh, I'll show you what to do here so say I downloaded it I put it into my twitch folder um, you'll get a folder like this CLR browser for repack right click on there you're gonna wanna run the dot bat file uh, just double click that it'll install if you want to right click it and hit run administrator after it does its magic you're gonna to want to reboot your system right and you are good to go after you reboot um, you know you're good to go you're finished come back here to the same nightdev.com and come back to this place right here um, and then hit next now with this website you'll have to have a, a Dropbox account um, so now you'll just have to log in with Dropbox all right, so there we go. Once we're logged in with Dropbox, um, pretty easy, pretty easy stuff. Um, now you just kind of fill in the blanks. You put in your Twitch, your Twitch channel name. So mine would happen to be Tonka Toy XL. And here you get to kind of get an idea of which which uh, format do you want. You even get to choose the uh, the color of which that's a nice one because it's slim I that's the one I tend to like you can even change the color of it so whatever kind of theme you're going with you can change it to that specific color I tend to go with blue a lot um, so like a nice little like a nice little sky dark blue right there true blue um, and next uh, we want to go ahead and add a song right but it only takes uh, OGG files right so you're wondering how do I how do I create my own OGG file right so uh, you can either just do a Google search and just say OGG file uh, OGG songs and this will give you a whole bunch of uh, OGG type songs you can just kind of browse here and look for them or you can actually create one um, you know just using a converter that they have right here on their website sound must be in the OGG format you can convert here so that's a pretty useful one um, so basically if you have an mp3 file on your on your computer um, let me see if I got one uh, I have one right here um, load load the song in there there we go and then you want to be able to um, you can trim the audio right so if you listen to the song and you say you want to hear a specific part of that song only in your in your because you can only do eight to nine ten seconds right so you can only get a certain amount in there so you want to have it the to the amount that you want to cut it at so uh, what we'll do is we'll kind of listen to it well, I don't want to get in trouble for my copyright. Um, so uh, just say you listen to the song and you say, okay, at, um, let's see, uh, zero, zero, comma, um, 17 through zero, zero. And then we'll just do zero, zero. 
this is just for an example obviously you'll want to listen to it and you'll want to time it of where you want it to be cut um, so we'll do that there um, and then uh, let's see put another song there we go we'll put that one in there and then just hit convert file it'll do it for you it'll do it download it ready to roll then you just it's processing and this is probably the most tedious part of it if you want to have a specific OGG file save it to your desktop and you're good you would just upload that into there choose file and then just run to your desktop and there is your song right there there it is boom OGG format ready to roll and you got it right so hit next it's gonna generate your code and that's an important part see this long code keep that around next you're want you're gonna want to run on over to your OBS load it up create a scene so you go to the scene where you want to have your uh, your uh, your specific of uh, twitch follower alert right so say you want to go ahead and say I just have it in test right so we'll just do this for now add CLR browser that's that's the thing that we installed earlier with the the dot bat file and we had to reboot our computer once you do that you'll have you'll have access to it you'll see it now when you right click and hit add you'll now see CLR browser that's good you want that so what I do is I just name follower alert and then you'll get exactly what you what you want that that URL link you already know what to do you already see what's happening here copy that link in there right boom and then go back to here your OBS paste it and you notice you can even change the width and the height of the actual uh, of the actual uh, size see how it says recommended 580 let's go ahead and do that usually it's usually on the money so we'll put 110 because that's what it recommends an also cool feature is that you can actually um, add these little digits right here and uh, and ampersand preview equals true you can add that at the end to kind of get an idea of what it'll look like right so we'll do that we'll add the preview so to give us an idea and just to give you an idea of how it would actually look check this out I'll show you see it'll come like that I just cut off the music real fast because uh, I didn't want to get in trouble for copyrighted um, but that's what it'll be like so um, it'll come out like that so definitely remember to go back to your end preview sign and take that off so now whenever somebody follows you on your twitch account you'll they'll get that an, uh, alert there so pretty cool um, definitely comes in handy and then you're done you're done on that website there um, that would be it um, then be sure to check it um, but that would be pretty much it guys it's it's pretty self-explanatory the most uh, tedious thing I saw was just the OB, OBG uh, or OGG um, file if you want to add your own custom music um, of course you can put anything as long as it's between nine seconds um, or you could just go in there and uh, Google um, little clips that are OGG files and you can use those um, but that would be it guys I hope it was useful I hope it was informative um, that's all I got if you got questions I'm gonna start being a lot more active I got the the YouTube app now so I can I can actually respond to comments a lot faster on my phone so I'm always working but uh, uh, I'll definitely try to be uh, able to answer questions or or throw me a text uh, it's in my home page if you got a quick question I'll, I'll respond to you alrighty guys thanks for watching I love you this is home slice 794 Later.